What's up guys, Peter from Panda here. Hey, I'm outside by my uh, basement window well and I just bought something. Look at this. You might not be able to <laughs> tell what it is, but it's one of these transparent covers that goes over those window wells or basements. And uh, as you can see, mine is circular. It does have a cover on top of it and it's a pretty decent one, a plexiglass type of thing. Uh, so I'm actually not showing you the one that I'm actually looking to replace the cover on because it's actually kind of behind a bush and out of the way. But the existing one broke. And these plastic covers tend to be pretty expensive, anywhere from $50 to $150 or more. And you can get them in a variety of materials. Uh, obviously you can see here, mine is clear. And the good thing about that is one, it lets in light into the basement so it doesn't feel like a prison. Now, I ordered this on Amazon because it was like the cheapest one I could find. It seemed like the dimensions were about right. And I just really wanted something to kind of get me through the spring to make sure that the window well doesn't fill with water. They can actually fill with water like a bucket and break your glass. And so I picked this up. And this one is by Mac Court, a window well cover. And you want to check the dimensions of your, you know, window wells. And this one is going to be a little bit on the small side. It is clear, and it's not like a translucent clear. It's a definitely a clear clear. And the material is pretty flexible. It's kind of like that same plastic they use on blister pack packaging, but obviously quite a bit thicker. I would say it's like two millimeters thick. So it's not as thick as uh, this like plexiglass type material, but it should be good enough. And it does have a pretty big ridge along the edge. So if you wanted to install it and then drill a hole in it and put a screw through it to kind of hold it in place. And then I will say down here, on the bottom, there is a flat at lit, or lip all the way around, so you could potentially screw it or tape it or put rocks on it. And then as you can see here, we do have uh, some ridges, some texture on it for not only, I'm sure, shape and holding its structure, but then, you know, a nice angled edge with those lines to drain off water and things like that. So, fits over window walls of 40 inches or less in length and projecting 16 inches or shorter in uh, depth. Now, the best part of this thing is it was only 10 bucks, so I'll put a link to it in the description. Peter Rump, hand out.